been around New Orleans. He knew who I was. You know what I'm saying? You know how him and my pops was. So he knew who I was. He got a son, like two years yeah, old. Yeah, yeah. He yeah. rapped too, right? Yeah, we connected. You know what I'm saying? I keep a G. Nigga, play with me. You know it's R.I.P. Been up for weeks, popping out of road, smoking hella weed. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Wow, I hear you speak on Juvie a lot too. How did you and him, how did you even link up with Juvie and all that? Um, Just being around New Orleans. He knew who I was. You know what I'm saying? You know how him and my pops was. So he knew who I was. He got a son, like two years old. Yeah, older yeah. Him. He yeah. rapped too, right? Yeah, we connected. You know what I'm saying? I keep a G. Nigga play with me. You know it's R.I.P. Been up for weeks, popping out. Smoking Once me and this son connected, like I was going through times in my life where like I ain't really had nowhere to stay. Mm -hmm. So they used to let me stay at their studio, you know what I'm saying? I had a Dope. shower in there, Dope. couch I could sleep on, like so and he used to let me recover for free. Man. And he and he let me actually let me watch him build studios, you know what I'm saying? He he, he like brought me around, like welcome me to my welcome me to his family, like, um, Man, his wife really loved me, you know what I'm saying? Young young Jew mama, she really loved me, so it's like a lot of stuff was coming from her too. Like I done got out of jail, ain't had no gun, like she done bought me a gun before. That's yeah. love, yeah. Love, like really. So like, she bought you a gun just so you could protect yourself. Protect myself, like not on no go get into nothing. You but know just what I'm protect saying? yourself. Like I done got out of like I, I went to jail a lot a lot. And you out here butt naked, she like, I gotta make sure you good. She just know how me and her son rocking and she know how what, what it is with me and him and how we coming, you feel me? Like, mm -hmm. she was always be like, talk to me, like, don't hide nothing from me, you know what I'm saying? Talk to me, like, she was a sit down and really had, like... She from New Orleans? No, she from St. Louis. Oh, so she just wasn't trying to hear it. She knew the flavor, though. She a gangster. <laughs> she cheated up. Listen, man, she is a gangster. She probably more gangster than Juvenile. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm you? That's dope. Real tough. I love it, man, because you have bro. to be, man. She probably, like, she really, like, one of the most realest down to earth person, women, women, women yeah. that I ever really just had real conversations with. Like, like me and my mama had real conversations, you know what I'm saying? That's just cause I feel like my mama, my best friend, I could tell you anything, but anybody outside my family, like me and her just, we locked in. Y'all like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, but they whole family, like they love me, like, you know what I'm saying? That's crazy. So, so Juvie I, just took a took a liking to you. Juvie, that's dope, man. And his son. I and really his think wife, it was based you know? off the relationship I had with their son. Yeah. That really made them like, damn, well, he they really like like they really got each other. You feel yeah, me? Yeah, they got each went other. Through a lot, you feel me? Like and he he done went to jail like I done got him out because I ain't even got to call your mama. You feel me? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. We only got to call your parents, but I got you. I'm going to come yeah, get you. He going to come give me. Yeah, that's love. Send me money. Like, the daddy done gave me money. I just got out of jail. Hell, man, here goes some money. You feel me? That's family. Like, young Jews, be like, like, even when we was flat broke before I even went to jail, start going to jail and all that, like, He's be like, brother, you don't got no money. I'm gonna buy you some food, put some gas in your car. That's like, family. You know what I'm saying? It always was love. And a lot of people don't really know why. Like, they be wondering, why you took to them like that? Because they was more family to me than a lot of my real family. Boy, that's family. real. That's real. And it be well, like that sometimes, man. So, that's that's beautiful, bro, that, that you picked up on it and that you didn't abuse it, but you embraced it, and that's love. I'm not no user, and I ain't never really needed nobody. Like, that's what people really love about me the most. Like, I'm going to go get whatever I need. You feel me? Whatever I need, I'm going to work for it. Like, whatever I got to do, like, no matter what, I'm going to go get it. You know what oh, I'm saying? Really? Ask nobody for nothing. What was it that she, because I'm talking from a mother perspective now, what was it that she had said to you that got you um, to break through to her, to be able to open up to her? Because, you know, being a mom, sometimes your kids don't be opening up to you and trying to, you know. My tell mama? You. No. Um, Juve. Juve. Right. Um, probably when she bought him the gun. Like, that made sense. Nah, 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 that was, <laughs> that was after that. we was already had a relationship. I'm just messing with it you. It was just basically... Just a relationship I had with our son, and like the relationship they had, you know what I'm saying? He used to be telling her a lot of stuff I was going through, so she used to be reaching out and checking That's real. on me, like, "You okay? You good? You need anything? You know you could call me. I got you." You know, some friends would have been mad, like, "Why you be telling your mama everything? Don't be telling her." Nah, you feel me? Because <laughs> I, like, for you to tell her that, you gotta have that relationship with her. Yeah, right. so people don't be having like I got that relationship with my mama. Like, my mama. 
knew a lot of the stuff. Like, even when I was going through it, I used to be like, man, mom, mom I sleep, slept in my car last night. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Who, who the why reason? You know what I'm saying? Like, she'll be like, well, you're going to figure it out, baby. It's going to get better for you. But mom, like I said, my mom always was somebody who worked three jobs. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Like, three regular jobs. Like, that's real. It was different, you know what I'm saying? That's but that's real. good for you because you ended up growing up seeing that work work ethics. Yeah, and I my, my work ethic is out of the roof. Anybody will tell you that about me. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk.